Hello, let's play a bunch of daily word games. Today's bonus game is Squirtle with an E. So let's start with finds, because it's a word search type thing. Um, what am I, I think on the right, I want to put that N somewhere, get all new letters otherwise, of course. I always want neart to be a word. I feel like neart should be a word. Um, probably something like tra train, no, uh, what am I, what am I trying to do here? Uh, trong, uh, we could do wrong. Wrong is actually pretty neat. Let's do that. It placed the N and that's all it did. We got an R on the left. I think we still don't have quite enough. Like it could be rise. No, it can't be I second actually. Um, well, either way, there's probably a lot of options. Let's look at the right word some more. Um, how about teeny or teeny with, yeah, double E. Sure. Why not? Let's have some fun. All right. There's a T on, so it's probably like strip. It's not strip. Oops. It is S. It's shirt. Okay. Oh, it could have been skirt also. I got lucky. Ooh. I should not have been guessing that word in the first place. Uh, but I'm glad I got lucky because if it was skirt. I would have to use skirt, do skirt, and then somehow figure out this right word. Um, we now at least have the opportunity for a filler or, or at least one wrong guess. Um, I'm thinking, but my first thought was L-A-N-T. Or, oh, it could be something like blunt. In fact, I think that's what it is. No, it's not. Um, oh, the aunt trap. Oh, no. This is the bad time to figure out it's the aunt trap. I think it's jaunt, though. Oh, it was vaunt. Darn it. Oh, I lost. I lost because I guessed strip. I knew I shouldn't have. Or I lost because I didn't identify the aunt trap here and didn't do a filler. But either way, <laughs> did not make good decisions on this one, and it made me lose. That's my fault. Let's move on. Let's do fibble. Ah, it's epic or epoch. Um, it's not epic, it's epic. There's a difference in pronunciation. Or it's epoch. Um, and my long form video with the most views like my shorts way out way out view it but i had like 110,000 views on a don't wordle video where the answer was epic and it got super popular because of all the interaction in the comments of tons of people arguing over the pronunciation of that word so i'm always going to remember that um a lot of people thought i was saying epic a lot of people were saying epic is a pro is a proper pronunciation a lot of people saying it's not um, <laughs> or a lot of people saying that today I learned Americans pronounce it this way. Um, anyway, we have a lie in this coloring. Um, what am, what am I? <sighs> Normally I just start with, with, I'd, I'd use, I'd use the green again, but we have to start with E and I'm not sure what we're going to do there. Cause then we would need to use the C again and bring in a gray, ideally. Obviously, we don't need to, but ideally, we would use the C somewhere else, and we'd bring in like a gray. Um, econs, would it accept that? No. Um, or, uh, all right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to guess early and just omit the C, because I can't think how we would do this. The E doubled down. Um, can I do elegy? No, that wouldn't have a lion early. Um, I'm thinking an EY word like this. Um, enemy? That works. Ooh, okay, so we have a lie between these two Ys. That means these two E's cannot be lying. Right, because it, it basically, if E was not green in the first slot, all three of these would have to be lying. The first one's not important though. These two would have to be lying, and now ha now that would mean that these can't both be lying because we only get one lie per right. If both of these are lying, then these would both be true, and they'd contradict each other. That's not possible. So that means the E that the E is in the first spot, and none of these are lying. Now, 
Do we have two e's? It's possible. Or this e could be the lie. If we wanted to bring the y in again, then this y would be the lie, and we need to have a second e and an n. So we'd be something something along the lines of e something n e y, or e e n something y, or like something along those lines. And I don't see a word for that. So I'm thinking that this is true, and this is our lie. And we actually have an L in the word. An E-L is pretty nice. Um, and maybe we don't have a second E? I'm thinking, I'm thinking we have no C and, and no second E. So I need to just use the E, the L, and the N in some way. It doesn't have to be in that order. Just got to move the L and the N around. Um, what would we do? Elfin? Ooh, I have expected Elfin to be correct. Um, one of these ends is lying. Does that help? Unfortunately not. Well, if we think there's an N in the word, then this N is lying, which means this L's telling the truth. We're thinking this N tells the truth, and the E is lying. This is what this is what I'm thinking. So we still start with E, obviously, and then we would still need an L and an N. But it would be something like this, or like like this, or that we're swapping them, something along those lines. I'm not seeing how to do that. So maybe, maybe what? Um, let Let's go back to the drawing board. So. I think we proved that this y has to be the lie, because if this y was telling the truth, then we would need e, n, another e, and a y, and there was no way to do that. So this y is lying, and this y is telling the truth. Now there's a lie between these n's. I think this c has to be lying, because how are we bringing in two letters from from Two additional letters from Epic. Um, yeah, I don't see how we would. So, thinking the C is the lie. Um, I'm wondering if the L is not the lie here. If the L was the lie, then we'd have an I, which might be helpful. And then maybe we'd also have an N. Like E something I... Oh, I don't like this at all, actually. Uh... What if it was elide? Does that work? That works. Oh, that wasn't it. Okay, we have a lie between these L's. Which means there is an I in the word. I don't know where it is, but there's an I in the word. I'm thinking we are E-L-I, ending in E. Is there another word? Like elite or something? Oh, elite. <laughs> elite. Elite. <laughs> Elite. So I just had one letter off there. Okay. Yeah, that was tough. There were some there were some difficult lies in that one. Cool. I enjoyed it. Let's do between all. As usual, I'll, I'll start bleh, as usual, I'll start with mouse. Perfect intro. Okay. So this orange dot is telling us that we're about halfway between mouse and the end of the, the alphabet. We're a little bit closer to mouse, because this is 21 and this is 24. So what do we do? Um, we're bottom heavy when it comes to mouse to end of the word. So like we don't want to go be exactly between M and Z. I think we want to wait towards M a bit. So let's try like rainy. See, I didn't even go far enough. Okay, I didn't go far enough of the R. No, right, not even, but I didn't. But there's a lot of words that start with R. So I'm going to actually try a word that starts with a late S. Actually, let's do an early S. Um, I think that'll help narrow it down better. Um, Sandy, why not? Okay, so 
I uh, now I'll try a late s s t strip. Perfect. Okay, so we're much closer to Sandy than to strip. So we could we could be S A, but I think we're probably like S E maybe or S H. Let's go S E. Maybe C D. Okay. So is there like a a late S E word that might be good? Like S E W? Um like sower? Okay. So I think we might be SH at this point, an early SH, like shame. Ooh, yeah, yeah, okay. SH, uh, shave then? That's probably, ooh, wait, that's too far, okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, shard? No? It's definitely SHA. We're halfway between shard and shave. What what are we? Uh, shart. <laughs> um, shaz something. What would do that? Shat. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> What goes in between this? Uh, what am I like shash or something? Shash was accepted. We're like right there. Shast, 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 shast. None of none of those are words. So I think we're S H A R. Z Y. What am I missing? Should I guess shart? Okay, it's not a word. Sharp, sharp. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that was funny. Might it take so long to come up with sharp? I don't know. Anyway, how'd you do? All right, let's play polygonal. Expert is on. We have a six letter word, and it's a sandwich word, as I like to call it. Um, so these two letters repeat, and these two letters repeat. Otherwise, none of the letters repeat. So. Like, I like something like vetted. All right, the E is correct. We just need a different consonant here. There's going to be a lot of options. Uh, maybe an ER word this time. So like, I don't know, yeller? That sounds fun. OK, so do we think we start with L then? Um, what do we put here? E-N, E-S. Ooh, how, oh, I was going to say vessel. But there's no V. Is there a different word for that? Not that I see. Nuclear Wessel. All right. Um, L E. I like less lesson, actually. Ooh. Well, the L goes at the end. That's forced. Fennel? Fennel. OK. That was a bit trappy. But we got there. A lot of words. Legged is fun. <laughs> I didn't think about the G. Double V as well is fun. Jara is an ordinary word. What does that mean? Jara. It's a type of tree. Okay. In Western Australia. Cool. Let's do symbol. We'll start with blaze. Oh, I, I didn't do the mini. I'll go back to the mini. Um. How about, I don't know why, shaft? <clears throat> okay, so yellow is not green. So let's, let's try an E there, and then the first letter, let's try a T. Just picking the most common letters here. Um, what can we do here? Like T-R-E, what? Trend? I picked the wrong letters. So the first letter maybe is uh, F. I don't know if F is good. And then an L here, like fully, just like fully. Wow, <laughs> from nothing to fully. Sweet. All right, we're going back. We're going to do the mini. OK, uh, we'll start with start. There's an R. Maybe this is R. Maybe we're like dryer. 
Oh my gosh, it's dryer with a Y. Okay. <laughs> cool. Let's move on. We'll do Fusel. Uh, we can start with dryer. That's fun. You know what? Let's start with start, though. <laughs> I like that. That's a good start. All right. We're going to get a lie in this next guess. This first one, we had to put a repeat letter. I don't know if that was clear. This next guess, we're going to get a lie in the coloring, just like Fibble. Um, I'm going to do truss. Okay. I mean, I know there's a lie, but still. Um, I'm thinking the green S is the lie. Maybe. Oh my gosh, this is this is confusing. Um, I'm thinking about Rusty here. I think it works. Moving the R, U, S, and T, and then we're assuming this last S is the lie. Wow, I got it. Okay, that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. All right. Uh, don't wordle time. Okay, let's play don't wordle. Every. Let's try that again. Let's play don't wordle. It's thinking of a secret word, and we are trying not to guess the word. But we have to always guess something that could still be an answer. So we do uh, kayak and then xylo. Oh, there's two L's in the word. So we're probably going to have to figure out the word and then use our undoes to, uh, to redo the xylo. Um, so I'm thinking ending in double L, but we could do, we could do something like level to start with. Perfect. That's exactly what we want to see. So now I, now I think maybe we, maybe there's a word that has L second, but it doesn't really matter. Probably ends in double L and putting the L second is still going to force the gas after to be double L at the end. So it doesn't really matter. Um, it could be something like swill. I uh, wonder if somewhere just like swole would be accepted. No, we're small. We're very small. Um, <laughs> it could be something like grill. It could be frill. It could be shill. Um, so I think I should try to use the O or the U if I can. Um, shoal a word? No. Um, There's trill. I'm trying to use uncommon letters though, if I can. Um, there's krill. I don't think krill is a terrible guess. All of these are common words though. Like all these are words that could be the answer. There's drill. I think there's a, there's enough R I L L's that there might be an uncommon one like krill with a C. Um, brill maybe. Okay. Okay, well, we just eliminated a ton of words because it's not R-I-L-L. -L. Um, I know I wanted to use the U or the O, but I couldn't think of something. Um, maybe there, there, maybe there was, though. So it could be shill still. Um, I wonder if something like smill is a word or snill. No? Um, fill, maybe? No. Chill is a word. So we have shill and we have chill. And what else do we have? Is will a word? No. We can't do quill. We already used the Q in kayak. Um, coil with two L's. <laughs> There's more than just shill and chill. There's six more words. Maybe gill like this? No. Okay. Or quill. <laughs> I'm trying. I don't know what else is... Be fill, okay. Ooh, so the answer is still. So we definitely have to undo this one. Now, what can we do if we did chill? I think we might be down to just let's try it though. Let's just see what happens. We have five words left. We just have to avoid the doing still. Well, spill is is an option for sure. Okay, nice. And I still had three words left. Wow. So what were these five words? Skill, spill, still, swill, and twill. Interesting. Cool. Well, I managed to do it, even though Zyla had the two L's. That's fun. Good to know that I could have.
Good to know that I can. <laughs> One undo, that's fine. Got a little unlucky, I guess, or maybe I just didn't use the right word. All right, we're finishing off with Squirtle. Um, let's see, what do we got going on here? I see chess. Uh, Q U words. Maybe we should pump those out. Quip. Quiet. Can I do quiet or something? No. Um. We got pans. Pens. Is nape a word? Yeah, then like the nape of the neck. Uh, pain is a word. Oh, probably a lot of words ending in double S. We already got chess. It's like quest's a word. <laughs> no. Um, bonus word is SU something. Soups. It's SU and then two letters. Interesting soup. Hey, that was that was the bonus word. Nice. Um cup cuppa? <laughs> Cube. Um We have pus. Why is pus a bonus word? Is it supposed to be one let one S? Weird. Um I got pens. Oops. Maybe I should be typing. Um, I got quip already. Why do we get the feeling that like there's a long Q U word? I can't. I can't see what it would be though. You'd think there'd be an S-H-E word, or a lot of them, <laughs> um, but it's kind of in that corner there. Maybe an S-C word? I'm not seeing that. Um, wow, I'm really not seeing very many words. There aren't very many, to be honest. Only 37 words is kind of crazy for this game. Um, it might be hard to get to the, <laughs> to the end here, or to get to the, the extra little, like when it gives you the counts and stuff. Okay, well, what can I do here? Um, I see Sue's, Q's, Pew's? No. Q U E U E no. Uh Quip. Oh well what about S Q S S Q Oh I see equip. E equip. So like equipment or anything like that? What about S Q U? Do I see Queen? I don't see Queen, right? Q U E E N no. Um Squip or something. How about sequence? Yes. And sequences. Yes. Okay, I like that. Um, What else do we have going on here? I think I see pence, but I think that I don't know if it's a, it's a C, right? Pence, it's still there though. Um, it's like hess a word.
Hmm. Still quite a few four letter words. Can I find them? Pex. Okay. Like your pectoral muscles. Um, might as well try next. I don't think that's going to be it though. Uh, maybe there's like an SES word, like ending in SES. Um, can we do like penses? Oh, we can do cents, right? And can we, we can do senses as well. Nice. Okay, so I have counts now. Eight words start with P. So I'm missing quite a few words starting with P. Push, for sure. Um, pucks, maybe? I think that would have a K. Puce, bonus word. Pew, uh. Two words starting with Q. Is I did got quip, right? Quise? No. Can't do queen. Interesting. Can anything be pluralized like quips or uh, equips? No. Or. I mean, that's all I've got with Q right now. Quest. Okay, let's let's not focus on that right now. Uh, two words start with C. Cup something. I don't see how. Q's. I got Q's already. I remember that now. Um, cuss. Interesting. Cuss wasn't even a bonus word. Um, how about cush? No. Can I do cushion somehow? No. Cusses. There it is. Cusses. All right. C is done. Um, how about napes? We should do plurals of words we've already found. Did I get pains? Okay. Um, pushes? Yeah. Did I get quips? I can't do quips. Okay. I think that's I think that's the plurals. Alright, cool. And now we have total counts. Oh, only one word uses that E on the top left. Oh, it would be nice to find that, but um Ooh, the E on the bot, the C, the E, oh, this, this E here is in 13 words. It's crazy. Um, one word starts with that U, like U, uses. Yeah. Um, one word uses, one more word uses the U that isn't the Q, U, <laughs> which is kind of interesting. Um, I don't know which one that would be. But for most of these words, we can avoid using the U, I guess. Be really nice to get all those Q U words. There's four more uses of of Q, and suspiciously two more words that start with E. So I'm thinking, oh, but if it was E Q U, it could use the top one, but it's choosing to use this one only. So what would that mean? Like I would need to do. Even that, yeah, okay. So maybe we don't start. Maybe it's SQU then. Or even at sequin. I think sequin just. How do you spell sequin? Sequin. Ah, oh, you can't do it. Okay, never mind. Um. Hmm. Lots of words starting with P still. Maybe we can pump out some of those. Uh, um, I'm not seeing much. Pies? Did I get that? I didn't. Okay. Um, three more four-letter words left. 
two more five letter words. <clears throat> There's a bunch of six letter words. Um, can I do scene? No. That would have been nice. Or sent. I got senses and sense. I got pans, right? Yeah. Something like pant pants a word or pant pants. I'm wondering about S H E on the right here. S H E something. I don't know. The fact that there's two more words starting with Q is is bothering me. Like what what is it? Um Q U I, Q U E. I don't know. I'm wondering if it's a word and it's plural. Uh, what would that be? There's two more words that are eight letters long as well. I might have to start revealing the hints here. Let's let's just do that. So we'll, we'll grab these two hints at least. So there's a, one of the words that starts with A is four letters long. I bet I could find that. Apes. Okay. And then two four letter words starting with S. One of them, I don't know if one of them's on the right or not, actually. Um, let's see if we can find it. Did I get soup? I already, apparently I already got it, but then I got it again. Okay, yeah. Um, seep? No. Scene? That's Sean. Um, Sex for seconds? No. Okay. Set. So, so, Sue's? Already found. Sends? I don't know. Snap. I see snap. Is Snape a word or anything? No, okay. Okay, so that was one of them. The other one's before S-U, but after S-N. So, or is that before S-U-E-S? -S. Is there another S-U-E word? Not that I see. So we might be S-E then. No, after S-N. Is there an S-Q-U something? Square? Square? No, school. No, it's not going to be that. It can't be S E though. S U. And then E or before E. There's nothing before E on the grid next to the U. Before Sue's. I might have to come back to that one. Uh, it'll probably become clear later. Two five-letter words starting with P. By the way, can I do snaps? No, I can't. Okay. Two five-letter words starting with P. Actually, maybe we should look at these longer ones. There's an ES word. And it has to be this ES. And then four letters and then an E. So it's, it's ES. Four letters and then another E. I don't know. Uh, there's Q, U, and then four letters and then E, S. So probably the six letter word with E, S at the end. I suspected that. Um, so Q, U, and then four letters. I feel like that's a huge hint, but I'm not sure what it is. Maybe I should reveal it. I don't know, maybe not. There's two words starting with P-I that are six letters long. 
So PI, then four letters. Oh, there's peak. Okay. That was a five letter word. There's peaks, which is a six letter word. Um, peak, <laughs> peakses, <laughs> no. The only use of Q is to start with Q now. That's good to know. Um, we also used up that E on the top left, which is good. We have a word starting with AP as well, with four more letters, up highs. No, we need more, more letters than that. Um, <laughs> that's the only problem with it. A piece, and then also piece, and then also pieces. Perfect. <laughs> Got all the peak taken care of. Um, wow, everything starts with this Q, E, or S now. That's kind of crazy. What word am I missing about? Like Q, U, E, A, maybe? Hmm. I can't do scene, right? No. Did I get cusses? Yeah, I got cusses. We don't start anything with C anymore. Um, I'm kind of curious about this A, because it, it either, either the word ends in A or we're going around this corner, like E-A-N, which makes sense, but what does that in this context, I mean? I can do a reveal. <sighs> I'm thinking about revealing this Q U word because I think it'll give me the eight letter word as well. And that'll clear Q off the board. So let's reveal this one. Quench and quenches, yeah. Quench, quenches. Okay. Doesn't really help me with the other ones, but two words in one for one uh, reveal is pretty good. Interestingly, this ES word that ends, ends with ES also is, is not a word without the S or the ES. Oh, no, it is. It's a word without the S. So if I reveal, I can't reveal this one, but if I did, I'd get both of those words. So it's, so it's ES, four letters, and then an E, and something that can be pluralized. But it, it doesn't start with that E. It starts with, it starts with this E. And then four letters, and then an E. Like SQ or something. S. What the heck? I'm not seeing it. Maybe I'll just reveal this word here. Let's just do it. What is, oh, seance? That's a tough word, seances. Okay. Um, I just have two words left. No, I have three words left. There's still a four letter word starting with S. What is that one? Oh, well, that would be good to know. It doesn't go left to SE. Whatever uses this U. Or SC. Actually, all three words use this C. So SC would make sense. Skin? Skew? skew? Skin? I did sex already. Like for short for seconds. Se sesh? 
Uh, it has to use the C. Seuss. Thank you. I can't even think like how we're using that. I get this other word, ES uses the C. Three more letters. He uses the ones with the two and off. Okay, so the U and the uh, okay, okay, because uh, it's a word and then it's plural, and we're only adding S. So I think this is the S we're adding. So this S is used only by this long word. This S and C are definitely used by the four letter word. This E is not. The U has to be used and the H has to be used. Hold on. Such. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I was that so hard to see. Um, such is just not a word I would think of. Weird. Um, and so now it's all of these two letter words except the S. So like S second. S. What the heck? Essence? Wait, how would we do that? S. Essence. As, Essican? What, what, <laughs> what the heck? I feel like it's got to be e essence. E How do you even spell essence? I thought it was E-S-S. E-N-C-E. -E, but I can't spell that. Oh, I can. Should have just typed it. E essence. Essences. There. Got it. Kind of a tough one. All right. It's because there weren't that many words, so it was hard to hard to find any. If that makes any sense. Um, cool. Well, those are the games for today. Hope you enjoyed them. If you did, then why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.